What was the difference in that fourth quarter? <clears throat> They made they made shots. I mean, they were just aggressive in everything they did, and they got stops and ran out, and you know they got some, they got some high level shot makers on that team, you know. So they made tough ones all night. And, um, you gotta give them credit. They just played with a lot of intensity in that fourth. So well lately in the locker room after a loss like that, how quickly do you regroup? What do you say? To regroup and move your mind forward. Yeah, we're frustrated. I mean, we want to win every game, and. Uh, it's a good feeling of being frustrated, but understanding that, you know, how we can get better from this and move on from this and realize we got three more games on this trip. So we can't be, I know we want to, you know, um, you know, get better after each game and reflect on each game, but we got to start moving forward and we understand why we lost. That's the good part. We got veterans in that locker room that understand as soon as we get off that floor why we took an L. So, um, you know, we just take that into the next game and try to get a win numbers is that a reflection partly of the back-to-back -back or something else no, I just think I mean they were aggressive going down here I felt like they used a lot of pick and rolls and we were planning to drop a little bit and they made those shots and then you know getting out and getting offensive rebounds to help them and you know when you got your they got uh, 15 offensive rebounds and they got three from IO and uh, uh, Javante Green got a couple, you know, I, I, they just, you know, it was a team effort for them on the boards, and I think that was the reason why they got shot. So I look at just the difference in shots, you know, they got 12 more than us, and that's really the game. I was going to say, considering, I mean, you guys got, you know, the offensive boards were damaging, but you still guard it well. I mean, is it fair to say that your offense is what the problem was in the fourth quarter? Yeah. And was that fatigue or was that them taking you out of what you wanted to do or? I mean they, they did it they I mean I mean you can probably I mean fatigue I don't know I mean I can't talk to my teammates and how they felt but you know I don't want to just throw that excuse out there um I feel like they got it they did a good job of getting it to us on our sets and we also missed some good looks rush some shots you know um trying to get back into the game once we got down five or seven I think we tried to rush and get back and once we got down 11 12 I feel like we was trying to get it back so fast, and then I just pushed the lead up. They hit a couple threes, got some transition baskets, but it didn't look as bad as the end, end score. You know, um, we were pretty much up going into the fourth. They hit some shots, and uh, we couldn't recover. Steve, you have a problem they close with you having Demar, Zach, Hooch, you know, different ways to hit you? Yeah, they got tough shot makers, and I think we, uh, I mean, the majority of the night, they were under 45% shooting. Um, until late in that fourth, but we did a good job of contesting those shots and just living with them. We can't get discouraged when you got all-world players like that that can make shots over players, over opponents. Um, so we stayed with it. We, you know, we you seen we had some spurts where we got stops, a lot of stops in a row, and was able to get a lead. But you know, some good offense beat good defense.